Alright, hi guys and welcome to the Zootles Light Suite. This makes lighting way easier inside of Maya. And the first part of the suite is the light presets. Just simply double click on an icon and you can change your lights instantly to a various number of hundreds of light presets. So all of the presets are included and we've also got loads of assets and rigs and other things that you can download from the site that come with the tools in the first month of subscription. So the way that the subscription works is you just have to subscribe for one month, download the tools, keep them forever, and then unsubscribe from the site. Now, if you want to upgrade at any time, then you just need to jump back on subscription, pay the new $10, and you'll get any upgrades. Now, the reason why these tools, are, we're selling them at rock bargain basement sort of prices is because we're about to upgrade to Zootools 2. And well, Zootools Pro 2 is a major, major upgrade for us, and the pricing is definitely going to change. So here is the Skydome browser and a big shout out to HDR Labs and HDRI Skies. These guys have been kind enough to allow us to include a lot of their HDRI Skydomes that come in the Zootools pack. Check out their sites for the mega high resolution IBLs. And of course all these IBL and light setups uh, can be scaled to any model size. This is great because we've got real Maya lights, you can grab them, you can move them around and do whatever you want. Which brings us to the light manager, and what this is, is a really simple interface for all the three renderers that we support. That's RenderMan, Arnold, and Redshift. And one simple interface that looks a little bit intimidating at first, but actually this is really simple and easy to use. And you can create lights without having to get into the attribute editor or hunt for different settings. We've got Brave Rabbits, Place Reflection. It's an amazing tool, that one. And here's the asset manager as well. So the asset manager is a little bit of a work in progress. Double click and you can replace any of these assets instantly. They clean up, all the shaders are cleaned as you replace the assets. Just note we're still working on texture support, so please be patient on that one. Of course, there's many other features in the asset library. One of those is the turntable that you can see here too. Alright, so I mentioned texture support, that is because the shader manager is just starting out. So this is our new tool, we're just starting to build this and add all the functionality to it. It's going to evolve over time. One interface for multiple renderers, easy one-click solutions to things like vector displacement, create your own shaders, manage them, chain shaders, copy shaders really easily. Lots of little features like this RGB matte support, instantly create RGB mats. And we've got a start of our convert renderer tool here. So this supports all the lights, IBLs. We'll convert those instantaneously along with shaders. Again, the texture support is coming, but even so, this is a very, very handy tool here. I use it all the time to convert my scenes to the different renderers. So as I said before, these tools all come with one month of the Create 3D Characters subscription. This is my site that I've been building for many years now. Over 80 hours of tutorials that you can check out there. So big thanks guys, enjoy Zootles and create 3D characters.